My name is Mrs. Alexander and I'm going to show you some easy tips and tricks to remember the first letter of all the states of the United States. The very first thing we're going to start with is can't. California, Arizona, New Mexico, and Texas. This is the Mexican border. You can't cross the border without the right paperwork. The next line you need to remember is NUC. Nevada even has a little V there to help you remember Nevada. Utah, Colorado, and Kansas. Now that you've got those states written in, can't and NUC, the K tells you all the states in this line have a K in them. North Dakota, South Dakota, Nebraska, and Oklahoma. Oklahoma even looks like a little oak wagon. Once you've got that, you just have these states over here left to remember. This right here has mountains, so that's Montana, kind of like mountains. This looks like a cursive I, which is Idaho, and then, whoa, you're almost in the ocean or almost to Canada, which is Washington and Oregon. Right here, there's even a little curve to help you remember that shape is an O, Oregon. There's one left. Why did you leave me out? Because I'm Wyoming. Got those. Now we just move on to the eastern part of the United States. The Midwest will start with here. Mimmel, M-I-M-A-L. This looks like a little gopher. This is the Minnesota gophers. Minnesota, Iowa, Missouri, Arkansas, just kitty corner across from Kansas, and then L, Louisiana. It even has the shape of the L. Once we have those, we're going to mop. Why mop? W-I-I-M-O-P. Why mop? Wisconsin, Illinois, Indiana, Michigan, Ohio, and Pennsylvania. Why are we going to mop? Wisconsin is ill in Michigan. Oh, the pain. That might help you remember those. We're going to start up here at the main state that starts the whole United States. Yep, this is the main point of the map. This is the state of Maine. This shape right here reminds me of a small letter H, New Hampshire. There's a V here for Vermont. This state has a big hook on the end, a massive hook. This is Massachusetts, where they could catch large massive fish. Next to that is the smallest of all and we know islands can be small. This is Rhode Island. Next to that this state connects Rhode Island to New York. This has a Y with an N. You can write an N there but it looks like the shape of Y, New York. And this state connects New York to Rhode Island. This is Connecticut. Down here we have a J for New Jersey. This little tiny one Beware, it might fall in the ocean. This is Delaware. This very um, oblong shape, very crazy shape. People there are merry because there's lots of water. This is Maryland. Next to that, we have this upside down V, which gives us Virginia. And west of that is West Virginia. Over here, we have something that looks kind of like a chicken leg or a drumstick for Kentucky Fried Chicken. Down here, if you draw a handle and a gun, this state has more than 10 people in it that own a gun. This is Tennessee. Going across here, we have MAG, Mississippi, Alabama, and Georgia. Most of you know this is Florida, which helps. And then all we have left, left is North Carolina and South Carolina. Those are all attached to the United States. And then over here, you should know that this is Hawaii and Alaska because they aren't attached to the United States. I hope this helps you learn at least the state names to get you started. Good luck!